am in Salzburg, Austria right now. Austria right now and the main reason that I came here is of course to see the famous movie sets of Sound of Music and the landscape behind me absolutely beautiful so pretty spot and do these steps look familiar to you at all? Uh, too bad I can't go in closer. Maybe I'll go try and get around on the other side of the gate. Alright, so I made it on the other side of the gate. These are the famous stairs for the Do Re Mi song. Where they like bounce on the different steps and sing Do Re Mi. So, so fun! Glad that I got to see the famous steps. It's probably the second biggest thing I wanted to see, and it's so nice that there were like hardly any people there. So awesome. Alright, let's go find some more spots. Alright, I have come to another famous spot here in the city center of Salzburg, or the old city center. And it is the convent where Maria was a part of. And it is right behind me. I don't know if I'm allowed in. I'm gonna give it a try. And yeah, let's go see. So unfortunately it's closed, but there are these, this little courtyard outside with a little cemetery and a path leading around. So I'm just gonna follow this path and see where it leads. So I just went in that little door to see if it was open, and it was, and I quickly left because I wasn't sure if I was supposed to be there. I felt like I wasn't. It was a tiny little room, but the courtyard's cute. I don't know if it's looking familiar so far. Maybe I can find a clip and insert it here. But I can't wait to go in. Which you see, I have confidence in me. Strength doesn't lie in numbers. Strength doesn't lie in wealth. Strength lies in nights of peaceful slumber. Alright, you guys, it has started to rain, so I have my umbrella here. Um, but I am at the Hellbrunn Palace or Castle. And this is another famous spot um, for the Sound of Music. The, um, quite a few scenes were filmed on the outside of here, so it's really fun to be out here, even though it's a little bit raining. And there's also another thing here on the grounds, which I need to find, and it's actually like the number one thing I have to see for Sound of Music things. And it originally wasn't actually at this palace, it's so somewhere else, but it became so popular and flooded with tourists that they moved it 
to this palace. So now I'm on the hunt to find it, and hopefully I can. It is now raining way too hard, so I think I'm gonna try and come back tomorrow. Hopefully I can get better directions and find out where it actually is. quintessential scene in the movie, my favorite scene, is here when Lisa was singing 16 going on 17. <laughs> Yeah, I thought so. Finally found it, and I have it all to myself. Thank you, Rain. <laughs> um, yeah, it's actually on the way other side of the fountain and of like this huge field area. And here it is, right there in front of me. The one thing I wanted to see when I came to Sound of Music, or when I came to Salzburg. One thing I want to see from Sound of Music. <laughs> That's right here. Like I said before, this isn't originally where it was. They had to move it due to all of the tourist attraction and traffic. So now it resides here. And actually, fun fact, um, I don't remember her name, but the girl who plays Lisa, she actually broke her ankle while filming. And I think if you look close enough, you can see her leg bandaged. And they actually use makeup to try and camouflage her bandage. But yeah. I was going to do some cheesy dancing around the gazebo, but then I felt silly, so this is what you get. <laughs> Alright, it is still raining, so I'm going to head back and dry off, because I feel like I am soaked. You guys didn't think I would come to Salzburg without going to the Sound of Music World, and I do. It's like a museum and a gift shop all in one, so I'm pretty excited. Let's head on in. guide for last maybe half an hour. Um, it was one of the ones where you just type in the numbers and then they give you a little spiel. But yeah, so fun. And there's so many inaccuracies with the movie. But it's Hollywood, so what do you really expect? Um, but yeah, so, so fun. So, a little fun fact that I want to share with you is that the 20th Century Fox almost went bankrupt before The Sound of Music. And The Sound of Music totally saved them. Also, since The Sound of Music, um, so if the prices were inflated for the sales of The Sound of Music, The Sound of Music would make the third top grossing film of all time. It was that popular and it was that big. It's so cool. I made it to the final spot and it is here, the Leopoldskron castle or palace and this is where the Von Trapp family lived in the movie. And it's so fun to see the beautiful lake from the side and it's actually now a hotel. Um, 
I'm not sure if I'm allowed in since I'm not staying at the hotel, but I'm gonna go take a peek. It's actually quite a beautiful walk here. If you had the time, I would totally walk around the entire lake or pond. It's really not that large. And there are ducks and swans in the water. It's beautiful. Well, there it is behind me. Locked and closed. It says pirate property and there's security cameras. So yeah, there's a fence. But what a fun time getting to explore Salzburg and see all of the Sound of Music sites. Well, I didn't see all of them, but I got to a good view. And you should definitely check them out when you come to Salzburg. So, I'm going to end the video here. I am <laughs> soaked because it is quite rainy. If you guys want to see what I get up to next, don't forget to hit subscribe and I'll see you guys there.